All sorts of intensity in the first two games. I expect nothing less here in game number three. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Cebulski. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. A chance in front. Big stop by the keeper. Quick work, he makes one and two saves in a row. Colorado's gained possession along the boards. Quick pass over to Landeskog. Colorado's on the attack. Slides the puck over. Quick feed to Kaprizov. Good hit on the play. The Avalanche have taken possession in their own end. Here's a short pass to Landeskog. And now he moves it to Taves. Simple stop by Fleury. Looks to pass it to Brodeen. Moves it quickly over to Eric Sinek. The Avalanche have the puck in the defensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Spurgeon. And it's a textbook body contact there. Colorado's got it in their own zone. Quick pass to Taves. Slides the pass over to Lekanen. Shot! He scores! He's tight to the net. He doesn't have much time. And that snapshot beats the goaltender from the low slot. The Avalanche have found themselves a quick one here to take the early lead. Once you get into the middle of the period, the game starts to take shape, and they can play from in front here. Colorado's won the draw, and tries to make a diagonal pass to Nichuskin. Into the corner. Official blows the play dead as the puck goes out of bounds. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Avs have taken a 1-0 lead. Minnesota's got it in the defensive zone. Spurgeon's taking it from his own end. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Nachuskin. Let's see what the officials are calling. Penalty killers better be sharp here, James. I mean, you're protecting that one goal lead, and now you're shorthanded. Here's a first look at the power play. Down by one, now you've got a power play. Make sure that you're organized and look for the tying goal. Comfers won the faceoff. The Wild have it on the attack. Shot! And he had an answer with that save! And he takes the dish. Gets in front of it. Manson's got the puck in his own zone. And a battle for that loose puck along the boards. And now he passes it to McCall. Minnesota's got it in their own zone. Poked away at center by McCall. The Wild have gained possession off the wall. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. The Wild have taken control of the puck. He's struggling to get to the bench now, James. Uh, pretty clearly. I mean, the goal is awesome, James, but they had to earn that power play. They had to shift over shift, started to put a little pressure on. Felt like there was going to be either a goal or a penalty. They get the power play and then don't miss. Colorado's won the draw in the neutral zone. The Avs looking against the half wall. Oh, the bar will play on! It was that close! The Avs can only shake their head. There's another chance to break a tie game. Nice feed. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Here's a pass to the middle. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. I know what he's trying to do, get into space to shoot it, but now you got to chase because you've turned it over. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And he 
takes the feed. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. The Avs played along the boards. Denies up with the blocker. What a stop by Fleury. Oh, what another stop. Why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. And he takes the feed. The Avs take possession in the defensive end. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. It's in. He scores. Van der Bench jumps right up. Both teams know the longer you stay locked in a tie, luck starts to play a bigger part of the victory. The man advantage break is sprung here, and they execute it perfectly. Two different views from either side of me. One coach not happy they gave up the man advantage break. The other one's pretty pumped with how they executed it. McKinnon's won the draw. Let's see what they can do with possession. Here's a blast! Oh, what a big time stop by Fleury! Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. The Avs slide it through center. Here we go, two on one. Gets it to the other point. Comes up with the stop. Moves it over to Greenway. Tosses it on to Steele. And now he angles it across to Polino. Colorado's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Centering feed. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Flurry's got it behind the cage. First period nearly in the books. Oh, boy. The Avalanche have taken over in the neutral zone. And now he tries to get it across to Merrill. Minnesota's going to play it from the corner. Here's a shot. Minnesota's close, but they can't get close enough. That shot hits the goal post and stays out. That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. Both teams back on the ice after the first intermission. Ray Ferraro, James Sabalski ready to bring in the call for period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, this one underway. Ray, give us an update on what your assessment is to this point. Minnesota's first period was a mess. I mean, they were late to almost every puck. They started sluggishly like they didn't have their legs. Sometimes that happens. Now they got to find a way to get back in the game, James, and it's got to start now. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. It's 2-1. Minnesota's won the face-off deep in their own end. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Quick feed to Erickson Eck. Good stand-up hit. Gains the zone from the right. Hammers it! And that caroms off a body in the lane. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. Can't make the connection on the pass. Moves it to Taves. Nice pass. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. The Avs take it along the wall. Here's a chance. And he puts that one aside with ease. He's on it. Good chance, but he's able to glove that shot. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, the Avs are clinging to a 2-1 lead. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. There's a collision with some authority. Slick feed. Here's a shot. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Flurry. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. inside the defensive zone. Greenway's moving it ahead. Moves it up through the middle from the right. Puck exits the zone. And we'll get a breather here with offside the call.
Steele's won the draw. And he slides it quickly to Spurgeon. Felino's got him in the offensive zone. decision, but they'll have to play on with this face-off. Face-off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Moves it quickly over to Johnson. They've got the defense outnumbered. Fires it! Great reactionary save as he gets a toe on that! Underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. And a little body contact on that play. And that's broken up. Can't catch up to the pass. Here's a short pass to Gostaspare. Scooped up along the wall by Comfer. Oh, no! We expected it to be physical. There's an example of where this game can get to. Made the stop on that play. Get that slop out of here. He makes the stop, and there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. And he makes the save on that play. With possession along the wall. Colorado's got the puck along the boards. Trying to clear. Picked up along the wall by Bleed. Oh, that had some hot sauce on that hit. Minnesota's got a hold of it along the wall. And now it's over to Patan. Poked away in the neutral zone by Taves. And that puck leaves the zone. And he hangs on to the puck. Shot! Oh, if that's horseshoes, you'd be right. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Colorado's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Puck grabbed by Manson. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Stopped by the goaltender. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. And he slides it quickly to Duhane. Dumps the puck in. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Here's a stretch pass to McKinnon. Tries to the crease. Makes the save with the foot. Taken along the wall by Middleton. And he passes it up ahead to Patan. Along the wing up the neutral zone. The Avs have it against the wall. Big open ice yeah. hit. Was it ever. He really closed off the room. Nowhere to go. The Wild have possession along the boards. Quick pass to Patan. Greenway's got the puck. Quick feed to Steele. The Avs play it along the boards. And the extended stick ends that one. And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. Feel that one. 
Poked away at center by McKinnon. Grabbed along the board by Brodine. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. And takes a tour out of the offensive end to find some space at center. Slides it over with pace to Landeskog. They're going to go. Do you like who's going in here? Yeah, you got to have it happen. You can't let one of your best players drop the glove. That had a whole lot of nasty, and it all seemed to be tilted in one way. Uh, pretty quickly, you could see there was an upper hand to be had in that fight. That's the way it played out. The Avs will want to build on that. On the road, you want to be as aggressive as you possibly can. Well, it looks like the officials have got all the debris off the ice, and we're back to getting some hockey going again. Steals gain possession inside the neutral zone. Here he is from the slot. Tremendous stop by Francis. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Gains the zone from the right side. There's a solid collision. From one point man to another. Hammers one. And that's blocked in traffic. And we've got a leader as he tucks it into the net. These teams are jammed together. That goal might open it up. Not sure what that hit, James, but it hit something and changed direction. The goalie just can't keep up to it. It's in the net. Colorado's had the puck on their stick all night long. Now they finally have a lead in the third. Yeah, but there's still a lot of time left. And they know it. The coaches are talking to them about not taking a step back. The Avs win the draw here in the neutral zone. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. And that's blocked away. Up along the wing. Knocked away with the stick by Johnson. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. The Avs gain control of it. With some open space at center. Quick shot. Makes the save. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Here we go. Puck's in deep. The Avs will play it from the defensive zone. And that's just out of reach. The Avs played along the wing. And the puck's kicked free. Shot. What a blocker saved by Fleury. Colorado's got the puck near the back end. Moves it quickly over to Bleed. Minnesota's got the puck. Greenway swinging the puck through center ice. And that's intercepted by O'Connor. The Avs have been talking about being better without the puck to generate more chances when they do get it. The coaches have been really happy with the way that they've played this game here. Intercepting pucks, trying to make more out of them than just the turnover. More than half the frame has been played here. The Avs are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. Erickson X won it off the faceoff. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by McKinnon. And play rolls on as he came up with a nice stop there. Rantanen's changed his focus here, James. It looks like he's finished fighting, and now he's going to play the game. And he was locked in on that save as play continues. Oh, wow, another great stop. And there's the whistle icing the call. A critical draw here. Minnesota's won the draw and they'll go to work. Small play, but a key play. Now you've got possession in the offensive zone. Can't get it to go. Oh, what a slick stop by Francis. Those bang bang plays are just that. So quick. Puck on the stick, puck off the stick. The goalie's got to be in the right position or they're not going to make that quick save. Oh, and that's got the crowd bussing after that stop. Here they come on the attack. That pass goes a little sideways. Takes it and looks ahead. The Avalanche have the puck in the open ice. Now the best defense is to play some offense as well. This is a smart play. With the lead, he dumps it into the corner. Now he can forecheck a little bit, try to kill some clock. Almost down to the final minute here in this third. Look at that hit. Maybe try to wear down the opponents here. Pass across to Johnson. Here 
fires a shot, and that goes off a body. Hartman's lugging the puck. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Minnesota's trailing, that's why they've got the extra attacker out on the ice and the goalie on the bench. Into the empty net. Great hustle to finally ice this one. Well, you weren't so hard defending the lead. Now if the puck bounces for you, it sure is nice to put it away. Colorado's added to their lead with the empty netter, and Ray, that's pretty much all she wrote, I would say. Well, you grind away to get the lead through this much of the game, and they pull the goalie, they're gonna pressure you. You put it away with an easy one into the empty net. Who's the puck? And not much on that one. Flurry's gonna hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Crowd's buzzing, ready to get things back underway, and I think the officials are too. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Wow, what a stop by Flurry! Nice zone entry from the left. The Avs have it from their own end. Flurry's at the bench, allowing for the extra attacker to jump on. Score! It's an empty net goal. And no, it was an idea. Doesn't mean it was a good idea because now they got to fish it out of their net again. The, the no goalie play is about getting the puck and hanging on to it. As soon as they lost it, you're in scramble mode. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Here he is, shot right in front. It is all over. They got a long way to go, but a big win this evening. Well, not as long a road, James, as if they would have lost this one. They were on the ropes here, and they came punching back to get themselves in the series. What a night. You gotta love the intensity of the playoffs, and we will see you down the road at the next game. It's playoff time, baby. Good night from all of us here at EA Sports.